Hey guys, this is Patrick from STH, and today we're going to talk about something that's you know a little different than what we normally talk about. And that is we're going to talk about the StarTech RK8OD, which is a open frame two post rack that really is good for edge location. So let's say that you have an office, you have a retail shop, like a pizza shop or something, you know, you have a really high end home. This is the kind of rack that you'd use to organize all of your gear. And it has some nice features that we don't actually see if you use some of the other less expensive models. I mean, this thing's only like 35, 36 bucks. So it's not exactly super expensive, but we have a couple features that you know we saw that are really good. And so we wanted to go into that today, and that's the subject of today's video. Now, the StarTech RK8OD is actually one of the least complex items that we review on STH. It's, you know, just a simple two-post rack. It only has five pieces of metal. There are eight screws total to put it together, but it's super useful. The total height of the 8U unit is only about 410 millimeters, which is like 16.1 inches, and that's about five-ish inches and maybe about 83 millimeters shorter than the 12U unit that we reviewed, you know, maybe a year or two ago. Overall, those two units you can check out. We'll link that review in the description. But the 12U unit is actually very similar in terms of depth and width. Now, although you put it together with only eight screws, you could go and put your own nuts on the back of it. We don't really think that's necessary because as is, the unit is rated at 50 kilograms or about 110 pounds of carrying capacity. That's pretty sturdy. Now, when you first put it together, it's not going to feel overly secure. I mean, there is a little bit of play at the top of the rack when you push the two posts together or pull them apart. But once you put a piece of gear somewhere in that, you know, face, say for you to all the way up to the, the top of the rack, what you're going to notice is that you get that cross brace and the unit becomes extremely sturdy. The unit itself comes with M5 cage nuts and screws. Specifically, it comes with a set of 20 of those. That set of 20 is good for about five pieces of gear because you use about four pieces of gear per unit. And so if you had five units, that's 20. And so that's good. We would have really liked StarTech to have provided enough for all eight U, which would have been 32. So that's an extra 12 of each. That would have been better. But at this price, maybe that's fine. Really, it kind of is fine because if you think about it, most of the one you gear that you get like switches, routers, even small servers, a lot of them come with their own cage nuts and screws. So you really can just use those. Now it's nice that StarTech provides them. We would have liked to see a full set, but what can you do at this price range, right? One thing we want to talk about that's really important about this unit, and it's different than if you were to get some of the like pro audio units that are two post racks, is that on the side of the unit, you actually see another set of holes as well as a couple cable management holes. So you can use things like Velcro, you can use zip ties. There are nice cable arms and hooks that come off of the side of this unit that you can actually attach to the side of a suit. So there are a lot of options when it comes to cable management running down each of the posts. And you have two posts, you could have one that's power, one that's networking, and there's a lot of options. And you just don't see that, especially with some of the kind of lower end telco racks with some of the racks that are designed really for audio gear. And so this is something that StarTech did that I really like. And we use it on the 12 units that we have in the lab and even in my office. We use it all the time, so it's great. Another small but nice touch on this is that the unit actually comes with rubber feet. So there are four rubber feet, you just pop them in. And the nice thing about that is if you're gonna put this rack on something like a hardwood floor or a desk or anywhere that could potentially get damaged by you know, putting a steel frame or onto you know, moving around, these rubber feet really help. And it's nice that they're solid, they're fairly large, and we really like this design. Now, the other option is you can not put the rubber feet in and you can actually screw this rack down into something using the same holes. And so that actually provides a lot of mounting flexibility, especially if you have to go mobile and you just need a small 8U of rack space. Now, this is, again, certainly from the fanciest item that we reviewed on STH. And frankly, there's a really good argument that you shouldn't buy one of these. The 12U RK12 OD is actually only about $10 to $15 more expensive. And for that, you get 50% more rack space by only giving up about five inches of vertical distance. That's really not a lot. For a lot of our users, getting the larger 12U unit actually is going to make a lot of sense. And in fact, we purchased the 12U units because we figured, well, why settle for eight when we could have 12 and it basically costs very little extra because at some point, you know, you're going to use it. There are applications, however, where that extra five inches or 83 millimeters is just too much. 
So for those applications, we actually think that the StarTech RK80D is way better. Now there's one other small item that we've noticed, especially with the 12 units that is not gonna apply to everybody, but it's something that the RK80D does much better. When you fill the RK80D, especially towards the top of the rack with back heavy units, servers that have power supplies in the back or something like that, because the RK80D is much smaller, much more compact, it's actually more stable than the RK12OD. So depending how you're gonna load it, that might be something you wanna consider. Overall, if you have a small rack and you just wanna get things more organized, you want all these rack mount units to be nicely stacked, you wanna be able to do cable management on the side, the StarTech RK8OD is an awesome unit. We buy these things, we use them in the lab ourselves, so certainly something that we can recommend. Hey guys, thanks for watching. We really appreciate you sticking with us while we get this YouTube channel up and getting a little bit better production quality. We're really working on it, but you know, there's some things that are not great still. We're going to get there. In the meantime, why don't you head over to the STH main site and see all the great content that the STH team is making every single day. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel. In fact, please do that and turn on notifications. You can also check out some of the items that we have in terms of already uploaded videos. We have some content, we've been working on it, and we're going to have a lot more in the coming months. So thanks again for watching and stay tuned for more.